Welcome to Tucked In Tuesday. We're so excited that we get to be guest readers today. I'm Mrs. Baser and this is my daughter, Lily. Lily, we are so excited. We chose a book called If You Were the Moon and this is written by Laura Purdy Salas and illustrated by Jamie Kim. What would you do, Lily, if you were the moon? I would hide behind the corner and scare the sun. You'd scare the sun? Uh-huh. But then we wouldn't have daylight. Well, yeah. <laughs> I think if I were the moon, hmm, I would help watch over all those nocturnal animals that come out and live at night. Well, we hope you enjoy the story today, If You Were the Moon. show you the title page is kind of funny. The moon is doing a little ballerina twirl. Hello up there, moon. I'm so tired. I wish I could do exactly nothing just like you. But I do so many things, child. And if you were me, you would too. If you were the moon, you would... Hover near your mother. Help keep her in balance. Spin like a twilight ballerina. Now there's little facts on each page too. Maybe we can share a few of those at the end, but we didn't want to make this story too long. But there are some really interesting facts. Play dodgeball with space racks. What? <laughs> Does the moon really play dodgeball with space racks? That might be kind of fun. Yeah. Hide in the shadows. There's the sun and the earth. Notice how the moon gets its light from the sun. Tease the earth. Peekaboo! <laughs> Catch and throw. Catch and throw. Wow, the moon gets to have a lot of fun at night. Yeah. Challenge the ocean to a tug of war. Ooh, tug of war with the ocean. Be a bright alarm clock to wake the night. Cute little owl. Yeah, I like that owl. Mm -hmm. It's pretty. Light a pathway to the sea. There's little tiny baby turtles down here, if you guys can see those on the ocean, on the beach. Weave a spell over wonders. Hmm. Wait for friends to visit again. Whisper wisdom from the sky. Sing a earth a silver lullaby. Oh, that's sweet. The end. So I wanted to share one of the facts from the story with you. This book is full of amazing facts all about the moon. But here's one of the facts that I wanted to share. 
Do you guys remember this picture here with those sea turtles? Well, the moon has a lot of jobs. Lily, would you like to read this fact about the sea turtles? Sure. sure. Okay. When sea turtle eggs hatch on shore, the hatchlings instinctively... Instinctively? Uh-huh. Instinctively scurry toward the brightest light that is usually moonlight sparkling on the ocean calling the tiny turtles to their home in the sea very nice so those little hatchlings use the moon's light to make their way to the ocean safely the so that was the moonlight it really helps mm -hmm. it helps guide those turtles we hope you enjoyed the story tonight for Tucked In Tuesday. Have a good night. And what would you do if you were the moon? Hmm. What would you? Good night. Bye.